Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, Selena101Q. This video is an update about the Netflix series that was announced last year for Selena. It is very exciting to see that Netflix finally released a sneak peek of what we could expect for the series. Um, we're also going to be talking about what I've been seeing so far, of mixed reviews of people uh, talking about what they think of the series and also about Christian. And uh, again, if you haven't actually seen the trailer, I'm going to have the link in the description. Make sure you watch it first before watching this video because I'm basically going to be talking about it. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. All right, so right off the bat, we see that Christian, which is the one that's portraying Selena in the series, um, is reading the script for it, right? Um, this kind of gives you... A idea that this clip is mostly about her preparing for the role rather than being a trailer I think that Netflix is gonna release a trailer an actual like trailer of the series later on down the road and this is more like a um, a way for people to get a little excited over the series uh, if you keep watching this um, it's kind of like she's practicing so she's doing like you know the hand movements right so she's kind of like trying to get into the spirit of it and then you know she's getting ready so it's kind of like behind the scenes um, putting on the red lipstick dancing preparing for the role the part that kind of throws me off is when she's walking towards the uh, character that seems to be the one that's going to portray her father it's kind of like you know hey wish me luck kind of a thing which is uh it's kind of like she's already getting in, she's like merging from Christian and Selena. So she's kind of like, I'm still Christian, but I'm also merging into like the Selena role. And then um, she sees like the little girl that I am assuming is going to be portraying the a little Selena. And you know, kind of like, you know, como se dice en español, like, salud, está saludando a la niña. And then, you know, she proceeds to go inside the studio, Netflix, and they're uh, filming her practicing, like, doing her thing on the stage with a microphone. Um, it, the cool part in the end is that you could kind of hear, uh, if you pay attention, uh, the voice of Suzette Quintanilla, which is Selena's sister. And she's like, all right, Christian, it's time to shoot. You know, it's time to get ready. It's time to go, you know. And it's kind of like everything's coming in full circle. So she got ready. She's been preparing for the role. And now she's in full character. Let's go and do this thing. I think a lot of people are confused because the sneak peek show doesn't have the vocals of Selena's original soundtracks, live versions, studios, whatever, right? And... I think that the series is still going to use uh, Selena's vocal or like original songs. Um, I just think that this sneak peek was more of her uh, preparing for it and that's why they, they used her voice. Now let's get down with the mixed reviews and I've been seeing this since it blew up, right? Um, first of all, it's like you have one side that are appreciative and you know they're excited for the Netflix role oh I'm sorry they're excited for the series and uh, you know it's cool that Netflix is coming out with this and the family is behind this so it's all approved by them um, and it's gonna open doors not for not just for Christian but also for um, whoever's gonna be in the series and it's gonna be exposed to the new generation which is cool the flip side to that is that people are still very much upset is and it kind of reminds me of what Jennifer Lopez went through back in 1996 when they did the auditions 97s when they finally released it um, is that you know she is not of Mexican American descent Christian Serratos is Italian and Mexican so it's kind of like the people who I used to see or like the type of people who I used to see always bashing Jennifer Lopez and she's been getting bashed since 1997 imagine that since 1997 people have been bashing J-Lo for playing the Selena role like 
she if she hadn't done that she would have never been famous that you know she'll never be like selena she's like all these negative comments and now i feel bad for christian because all of that is gonna be also like given to her like it's gonna be something that maybe 20 years down the road she's gonna still get bashed for playing this role on the netflix series which goes to say i feel like no one will ever be uh satisfied uh, you can't make everyone happy and you just gotta do what you gotta do so um unfortunately like i said like there's no way that uh you could em fully embody selena um because there will only be one selena right and you know christian is an actress she's gonna i'm sure she's gonna do or she has done everything that she can to do this role just give this role justice um and i i'm really excited to to see where this goes and i just feel bad for her because there's so many people who are against her doing this and i think that even if they had chosen someone who's so like quote unquote looks exactly like her i think people will still find something to talk about well, I hope you guys like this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of the series. Are you excited? Uh, do you have other opinions uh, from different from mine? Let me know. Uh, try to keep it PG. Just saying. You know, there's, there's children around here, right? Uh, but, I mean, if you must not, I guess, go ahead. But, you know, it, there's no point of it. Just so, my opinion is my opinion. And I hope you guys, uh, you know, are excited or just as excited as I am. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.